Hello folks and welcome to the channel and in today's video we're going to have a look at the new AMP repository from Audio Assault. This is the AMP Locker, so let's check this out! So yeah, this is the AMP Locker from Audio Assault. Now at the minute it's in beta uh, and a lot of people have pressured Alex into getting this out so he's released it as a beta there's still one or two little things that he's still working on and I think there's one or two little niggles that he's yet to iron out but people have bugged him that much that he's just released it got it out there <laughs> it comes with one free amp which is the Prestige 1959 so as you can see that's based on a 59 Marshall now if you've got the uh, the Hell Beast and the AHM 5050. You should get them. You should have had an email and you get free downloads for them. And it does come with two brand new amps. So we'll have a look at those in a moment. So we'll have a quick walkthrough. It's not going to be a full review. I'll wait while the, uh, the sort of full thing comes out. And we'll have a look, quick look at each of these amps and uh, I'm not going to do full reviews on them in this video it's just a quick low quick things dial in a quick tone and then we'll do other videos on them later now the amp locker this is like I say this is a repository if you will easy <laughs> so so this is the new place where all the new the newer or the new audio assault amps are going to be in so it basically it's like say with drum programs with you where you've got different drum libraries it's a similar sort of idea if you will so all the all the new newer amp sims are going to be in there and basically it just tidies your door up as well so instead of having a long list of amp sims you just got the, the one sort of portal if you will and they're all in there if you've got the older versions of the hell beast and the 5050 the hm 5050 you can still use those old versions like you could when it upgraded from version one to version two or the ex version so i say it come the, the prestige 5950 is a free one so as you see that's based off a marshall in front of the amp, you get your pedal section, and you get all sorts of different pedals. You get some overdrives, you get a uh, compressor, tremolo, a chorus, and a wah. At the minute, they've got four slots. I don't know if there's going to be any more, but you can have up to four slots. Then you've got your, your amp section, and then you've got your, your 3D cab section. So there's all sorts of different 3D cabs. You can have IRs, so you just get a WAV file, or you can load your own IRs, which is pretty cool. And you've got all your controls in there, so you've got distance, panning the, the room in, blend the room in, that's it, blend the room in a bit more, volume pans, high and low pass filters, and you can have a mix of the two, and you can grab the microphone and place it where you want all the cabs. And you get two of them, so you can have a blend of two different cabs, and there's four different microphones, so you've got a 57, a 421, 414, and a 121. And then after that, you've got your After Effects section. This is default prestige, so uh, it's got two delays in there, but you can have EQs, there's a graphic EQ, parametric, uh, Two different compressors, a black and a red, reverb, chorus, and delay. So, like I said, this is the uh, Prestige 59. Then you've got uh, an updated version of the Hell Beast, an updated version of the uh, the 5050, the two no amps. You get a 56, 50 plus, if you can guess what this is. Yes, it's another 5150 style amp sim. <laughs> and the califier which as you see is a uh, maser rectifier style so let's plug the fiddle in we'll have a little play about with each amp and see what sounds we can get just down quick tones in for each one so we'll start off on the uh, on the prestige <clears throat> so we'll start off on the prestige 1959 everything at 12 o'clock <laughs>
as you can hear, it's a bit of a, a low gain amp. And neither of the pedals are on in front of it, so let's dial a tone in. You get your basic rock tone from there, and with the tube screamer on. just sort of tightens things up a little bit. So, we'll go to the next one. We'll have a look at the Hell Beast since we've got one of those already. Oh, default. <laughs> As you can hear, he's got a lot more gain in this. So let's just dial something in pretty quick. just like with the original channels so that was, was the high gain lower gainish and clean and you've got the curl switch as well which adds another gain stage Just tighten it up. But just for science, let's bang a tube screamer in there. Just for science. That's the uh, Hell Beast. And the other one that I've got already is the AMH 50. 50? Okay, that's everything at 12 o'clock. I've, le I've just left the tube screen switched on. Let me switch that delay off. I don't think we need delay on for these. To me, that, that gain is not quite as gainy, if you will. You can push that gain a little bit more compared to the original. But once you start getting to these high gain ones, you do need some gate on there. Mm -hmm. 
and same again, you've got your, your three channels, so that was the high gain. The crunch and the clean. In fact, we're not going to choose Screamer on because we went for the default setting, so let's bang the choose Screamer on. So that was the 50-50 and so again you can have it with the EL34s or the 6L6 but the GUI doesn't change colour like it did on the original while well, we're in 51-50 territory we've got the sort of more sort of original block letter Let's just dial this in a little bit. All right, same again. You've got your so you've got your two different channels. So I'm more of a rhythm channel, and then your your lead channel. We'll go with the lead channel. Default ones do seem to have that delay on all the time. <laughs> to me, I'd have put a tube screamer on as a default uh, with that tube screamer on. <laughs> So that is a 5650, another 5150 amps in. <laughs> Let's have a look at this califier. Let's bring that gate up. Two channels on this one. Of a, a lower gate. And. And a bit of a more higher gain and as you can hear it's got that typical flubby sort of uh, rectifier sound to it Starts without anything in front, and we'll take that delay off again. And we'll bang the tube screaming in front. See, so yeah, I think now we can add a bit more bass in. Take some of those mids out. 
Take the treble and the presses down now, down a bit. And just for the sake of science, let's swap the screamer for the hyperdrive, which, as it says, is based off a uh, SD1. Just for science, but yeah, nah, I prefer it with Chew Screamer. There you go, there was a, uh, I'm not sure how long this video is, but yeah, there's a quick overview of the amp locker amps that you get with it. I say, actually you get the uh, Prestige comes with it free, that's your sort of lower game Marshall style amp, the L Beast and the AHM 5050, if you've got those already you should have had emails and the uh, the 5650 and the Califier, those are separate purchases. But at the minute, they are on sale. I think they're about $7, give or take. In fact, let me just check that. Yeah, at the minute, those are still $7 or the recording of the, this video. Yeah, I'd say this is not going to be a, a full review because it's only in beta. But at the minute, I am quite digging it and I have used it on a track. Sorry about that. The, the, uh, the battery on the camera died. <laughs> <laughs> so, not sure where I got up to, but yeah, yeah, I have used it on a track that's coming up. I've used the Hell Beast on a track that's coming up, but actually not on that high again either. On one of the seven string, I've used it on a seven string track, but that's not been put out yet. <laughs> Hopefully, it'll not be long before that the full version is out. I say I'll do more in-depth videos on on the each individual amps in few in the future and with the uh the hell beast and the 50 50 i might do some comparisons and put them both in a in a mix and as far as i'm aware all the other ex amps they're eventually going to be in uh, in the amp locker as well but yeah let me know what you guys think about this down in the comments i'll leave a link to the Audio Assault website down in the description. It is an affiliate link. So if you buy anything off the Audio Assault website, I get a little bit of a kickback and uh, that'd be very much appreciated. If you want to grab yourself some evil wizard merch, there's a link to the merch down in the description. But that's all from me, folks. I will catch you in the next one. <laughs> right folks, I hope you enjoyed that video You can follow me on social media And you can get my music online And if you want to support the channel There's uh, Buy Me A Coffee and Paypal links They're all down in the description Click up here to subscribe And click the link down there for videos that you may not have seen Keep it loud and keep it heavy